good evening everybody and welcome back to pullback indicators as you can see the markets have already closed and let's check out the performance of our indicator for today 14th march Be strong. Be strong. As you can see this is a nifty 5 minute chart whenever we trade on index we use 5 minute time frame so today in the morning we got a buy signal here in nifty futures here the trade happened on the closing of this candle and from 16720 it went up almost till 16886 a very very big move for nifty futures then we have bank nifty for bank nifty futures we got a buy signal here in the morning and the trade happened on the closing price of the next candle but uh, we haven't recommended this trade today because the stop loss is very big still if some people have traded then they have got a very move, big move in bank nifty as well and one more thing i want to add in this many people who are watching this video they are saying that our signal is not matching with their chart that is because whenever you are selecting nifty and bank nifty you need to select index features they are selecting spot or some other contract if you are selecting some other contract it will not come or match so you need to always select nifty index futures and bank nifty index futures now let's see some uh, stocks this is a kotak bank chart for stocks we use a 3 minute time frame now let's see for stocks for stocks we have got a for kotak we got a buy signal here in the morning the trade happened on the closing price of the next candle at 1239 and from 1765 it, it went up all till 1790 levels then we have maruti in maruti again we got a buy signal here and from here it went up right till this levels next is sbi for sbi we got a buy signal here the trade happened on the closing price of the next candle we enter into the trade only when the closing price of the next candle is higher than the signal candle then only we enter and from 474 levels it went to 484 next we have acc acc we got a buy sell signal here and as you can see the trade did not happen because the next candle or the next 4 to 5 candles the closing price of the next candle was not lesser than the closing price of the candle in which we received the signal then again we got a buy signal here and the trade had executed on the next candle and it went up right till here uh, let's see infosys for infosys again we got a buy signal here but you know the stop loss was very big so we did, we don't recommend uh, trading on this script next is britannia britannia again we got a buy signal here in the morning the trade executed on the next candle and it went up right till here and we ignore any signal which comes after 2 pm and also we ignore all signals in the first signal if we make profit we ignore the remaining signals let's check out one more stock uh, this is axis bank axis bank we got a buy signal here in the morning but no trade happened similarly again we got a back to back sell signal again it did not happen then again around 113 we got a buy signal the trade executed in this candle and from 700 levels it went up right till 712 as you can see if you follow the indicator properly and use my trading strategy then you can recover the indicator cost in just one day this was all for today remember 
we cannot predict the market but if we remain consistent and stick to our trading rules with proper discipline and follow proper money management then our chances of winning will be higher and lead to overall profit the indicator works across all market segment in equity nifty bank nifty commodity forex and crypto along with the indicator you also get our strategy videos on how to trade when to enter where to exit and put stop loss this indicator works on trading view chart you can use this indicator on your smartphone and also your desktop browser you don't require any paid version of trading view in case you have any queries you can send me a message i will put my details in the description box i hope you like this video thank you very much for watching